to a new vlog as you guys have seen we just went for brunch this morning and then i've just been home all day chilling and now it's at 6 30 and i'm gonna get ready to go out to global village really exciting first starting i just want to say ramadan kareem to all my muslim friends out there who's fasting i hope it goes smoothly for you guys and god bless you what's been happening right i'm gonna tell you i got super ill after my last vlog i got really sick as soon as i started feeling better i'm like okay i'm gonna go out and start vlogging again because basically i'm doing these weekly vlogs now which is really tough i'm not gonna lie I basically need to be filming everything that i do um, and you guys are always asking for longer vlogs like Diana, do 40 minutes, do an hour vlog. Like, you don't understand. It's tough already. Like, so much credit to those creators that do, like, an hour vlog. Like, I cannot understand. And especially for all of it to be quality content. I would never be able to do that. I don't know what it is. Like, my content always comes out so short. I cut lots of things out because it's just not relevant. You guys wouldn't want to see that. Anyways, back to my point, right? I start vlogging. I'm like going to the pool. I want to start off with a time lapse of me in the freaking pool, right? I put up my camera on the side of the pool and I just start swimming for this time lapse. I turn around and I can hear a unfamiliar voice of my camera splashing down in the pool. And yeah, let's go find a new camera, right? It's not that easy because this one that I have, right? I've been loving it, but it's been discontinued in the UAE. I waited and waited and waited until I finally ordered it from the Canon um, showroom. Long story short, your girl's just been gone. It might not seem like it because I've still been uploading like once a week minimum but this basically has been happening. It's been two weeks since I last vlog so now finally we're back. So now that it's Ramadan basically um, lots of things are closed down and restaurants and stuff are all like kind of limited. You can either get takeaway or you have to sit inside to eat which is to you know respect the, the Muslim people obviously. Actually things are open much longer now because like after you've thought people tend to go out so like say we're going to global village tonight they're closing at three or two i think so yeah i think like there's gonna be more things happening towards the evening so yeah either i'll just you know get my content then i've never lived in a muslim country during ramadan i come from Kurdistan, but like i've never lived there during ramadan like my makeup is terrible like and i call myself a makeup artist Guys, I need to, I'll be back. So I am done with my makeup. I did like a natural, I'm gonna call it a natural, but it's honestly just base and then some eyeliner, mascara, and the lips pretty much has been my go-to makeup. It's so simple and it stays on forever. My fragrance of the night is gonna be the Lancome Idol. It's one of those scents that just lingers on you and it's beautiful throughout the whole day or night. It doesn't go away. I'm just wearing a oversized t-shirt. <laughs> Stop looking at me. <laughs> I didn't have the time to show you guys my outfit, but uh, because our friends are already in the cab waiting for us. Basically, my outfit is super chill. I'm wearing Zara jeans. Hi. And then a soft t shirt, little Gucci bag. I feel like we're always late to meeting people, which is so embarrassing. Hello. Hey. Okay, guys, so we are. I'm telling you, I'm giving you here because she's sprayed and her heads are burning. Guys, we're at Global Village. We sat at a Bosnian restaurant and we had, what is this called? Kebab. Kebab. Yeah. It's like kebabs, basically. You get it with bread and everything. It looks really good. good. You guys seem to love when I'm vlogging and eating, so I'm definitely gonna continue doing that because we love food. Hey, babe, for one more ketchup. Ketchup, did I have? Uh, you and me come from a brother and school. Would you guys put ketchup on this? Okay, Let me know in the comments. Can you throw it Du lyssnar i budva jag sitter. Jag tror de hade kusan utanför och slaktade den på plats för den var så färsk. Den är okej. It's so quiet now that it's Ramadan. I think it's because they can't play music here. But usually this place is popping. Like there's so much music, so much people. It's quite dead now. But honestly. I kind of prefer we are currently going into China because they have so much stuff if you guys are into like buying stuff on wish or Shein, this is literally the same like I can show you for instance the first thing you see when you come into China is like lashes 
Look how many of them, guys. So yeah, I purchased some the first time I came here. And they're fairly priced, not the cheapest. But oh my god, they have so much fake bags. It's crazy. Do. Guys, look in here. Oh my god, this actually looks like real stuff. Guys, we got some mini pancakes. Look at that. So good. I'm gonna try them with you. There. So hot. It was so good. What do you think? Nice. They made it fresh as well, so it tastes even better. Time is around 11 and I have not found a single thing today. I wanted to buy a Arabic dress and also a pair of flats because they have so much shopping here. But I haven't found anything. Like, I just want a plain dress. And look, like, all the dresses just have so much happening. It's too much bedazzle. And I've been like in every single store, didn't have it, so I don't, I'm not gonna buy it. And also the flats, didn't love them, so I think I'm gonna have to go for like a special hunting just for shoes. But my background, amazing. Okay, so we're gonna grab a taxi and head home, go to sleep, and then we'll see you guys tomorrow. Currently doing my morning routine, brushing my teeth, doing my skincare, been working this morning, editing two videos, and I'm currently starting to get ready for the day. So I don't have specific plans today. Honestly, I just want to go out and <laughs> I honestly just want to go out and take some pictures. And I have been getting lots of questions recently on how I take my Instagram pictures. So I thought I'm gonna bring you guys along today in this vlog. I'm gonna go out by myself and bring my tripod and try to take some bomb pictures. We'll see, I'm like in the best mood today as well. So it shall be some positive vibes in it. Friends, I am finished getting ready and this is the outfit that I'm gonna be going out and taking the pictures in This is a linen shirt that I got from Zara. Love it. So pretty. My skirt is a sauce It kind of looks like a dress together, which I really like and then for shoes I just went with these from a sauce. They're kind of a dupe of the Jacquemus Which I really wanted but it was way too expensive. However, these are super uncomfortable So if you guys are getting them just bear that in mind like really really fucking uncomfortable for makeup I just gone with my everyday makeup which I actually did a video my everyday makeup chit chat one I'm gonna make sure to link it down below and then lenses are golden ochre I do have a discount code I'll put everything down below guys as usual but yeah we're heading off I have packed a little bag I have my tripod inside the little bag that I'm gonna be taking the pictures in and then some makeup hairbrush Dubai is super hot so like it's kind of hard getting content done I'm not even gonna lie so I'm gonna have to go be super quick and then head straight back home to the AC because I'm gonna die in the heat. But yeah, I'm gonna try to go find a location in the area, take some bomb pictures, come back home, I'll show you guys how they turn out. Guys, I just found a location to take my pictures. I've been going for like 15 minutes and I'm sweating just to realize that I forgot, not the tripod, but the actual thing that I put my phone on. So I have the tripod, like no problems, right? But then I need an extra thing for this bit, which I forgot at home. Ugh, I'm so upset with myself, but I'm like trying to be creative. I'm not gonna go home just to bring that, like it's not happening. <sighs> what do I do, guys? I managed to find a solution for my problem, guys. So I just put it up. Like this is quite unsure and honestly, I'm not liking the angles. What I do is I just put it on 10 seconds and then I just stand there and pose until I like the picture. And that's pretty much how I do it, guys. It's so hot outside. I think it was around 40 degrees and I've been walking for like 15 minutes to my location 15 minutes back taking pictures it's So hot god bless imagine summertime in Dubai. I know I'm being super dramatic, but like honestly I don't think you understand it is hot. It is boiling. It is sauna hot my photo shoot went quite well thinking about the fact that I didn't bring the little thing for my um, 
Guys, I'm still fuming on, you don't understand. Um, I managed to find a solution for my situation. It was a bit risky. My camera was constantly, you know, about to fall, but also I didn't like my outfit when I actually took the pictures. The only thing you guys might have noticed that I do to my pictures sometimes is I will put the um, lightning down, so make it super dark. And a lot of you guys are asking what filter it is. It's not a filter, it's literally just in the settings of iPhone, you can just make the picture much darker. That's all I do because I like the aesthetic of that. But that's pretty much it. Uh, I'm gonna sit down for a while, try to figure out which pictures I liked, and then, yeah, we'll see. Philip is probably on his way home from work as well, so we'll either do something later or grab something to eat because I'm starving. <laughs> so what? My makeup is literally ruined right now. <laughs> I feel really productive today. I've been editing, taking pictures, and now I feel like I can just move on with the rest of my day. Just you know, chilling, whatever I want to do, either go out for food, I don't know. Yes, we ordered chicken wings with fries, so Philip is just downstairs to go bring it. I'm just putting up all the stuff that we're really needing. I'm so hungry, like, I've had breakfast today and that's actually not even okay. Um, so yeah, it's later on, the time is currently... Oh, such a shame we don't have any Coke. Can I even Coke? Yeah, because we have. What? The commitment for beverages. Oh, great. So the food is here. I have to show. Hopefully it's still hot. Ramadan. Yeah, by the way, it's Ramadan. So we've ordered this food the time on iftar. And it's been taking so long to get our food. Like they delayed it three times, yeah. I think. This Let's is see. cold, yeah. The chicken strips are cold. Really? These Show me the wings. Are cold as fuck and fucking half. Full. Honestly, complain. You're gonna get your money back. Oh are my we? god, it's so cold. Mm. But the wings are fresh to go. Mm. Mm. This is hot. Okay, so we have the wings. Oh my god, I've been craving wings for like two months. And this is the first time we're getting it. You got coffee. Coffee? What's this? That's our beverage. Coke. So we got wings, we oh, got french fries. Oh my god, it looks good. What? Excuse me, I think he ate for my food. What is that? This is just this? some more chicken. But don't you think that is so little? Yeah. Mm. I'm obsessed with food. I'm going to have a good family food of Mukbang. Mm. Mm. Guys, listen to this crunch, okay? This is the chicken strip. Mm. We had dinner and got dressed. We are currently. I'm just getting ready to go out to the point. It's basically just a location on the Palm, which we've never been. We want to go visit. So I am wearing this cute little dress from Zara and then shoes are from Mango. It's going to be my outfit. I'm also bringing this big bag today because I have this thing in it. I bought this before I came to Dubai because I want to take lots of pictures and then I haven't been using it. So I'm thinking like these um, last couple of weeks that we're here, I'm just going to be like taking lots of pictures for memories. Waiting for Philip to get ready and so we can grab a taxi and head out. Can we take a minute for the fact they're playing Arabic music? Like I am living life. Like even though you're in Dubai, they don't play lots of Arabic music most of the time. Good morning guys, it is not even morning, it's actually 2 o'clock We have... Good afternoon. Good afternoon We've just left the apartment, Wait. came to La Mer which is the prettiest place in Dubai If you haven't been, 100% need to visit so We're gonna have like a beach day today which it's been a while Like usually we don't go to the beach because we have the pool and you kind of get lazy in Dubai, not even gonna lie so today's been actually like a month since we've been to the beach. You have the beach and then along there you have the restaurants and there's so much to choose from. 
He's been standing there for like 30 minutes. Oh yeah, dude. Guys, look at my background. It's so pretty. It's so pretty, right? I told you. So I basically came here with a girl called Cheyenne. She's also a YouTuber. I think she was the kindest girl like ever. I wish we had vlogged together. Um, she's from Rwanda actually and we came here together loved it and then since then I've been like showing everyone like this place it's just gorgeous. <laughs> look 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 life hack if you buy designer stuff you always get dust bags and I use this one as like a beach bag or like I just put my essentials in it and it just looks so cute instead of like just not using it and like keeping it at home you can actually use it how cute is that and I was thinking to put two long straps on it to make it a tote bag okay Waves are huge here and the fact that I'm vlogging like I dropped my camera in water like three days ago and here I am vlogging in water I'm crazy we were sat at catch 22 we had burgers so I had grandma's burger and Philip had chicken. the chicken Good chicken burger it's good mm -hmm. I mm -hmm. love fries hey, This, ladies and gents, is the best crap in Dubai. Good morning, friends. We're starting off this morning with a gym session. Haven't been to a gym in like a month. And lots of you guys have been asking how I keep in shape even though I eat a lot of trash food and honestly it's just my results from back in Sweden I'm already noticing my body is changing so I'm forcing myself right now to come back to the gym at least get like a small session in the morning I just need to move my body because in Dubai guys you don't move like at all you just take taxis and it's too hot outside so you barely move anything I'll do cardio a little bit of weight training and then I'm good and when I go back to Sweden it's gonna be so strict and I mean that like you guys are gonna follow along um, should we do like a body transformation video where like we train every morning together we eat clean food and then we get ready for hot girl summer what do you think comment down below Good to know your short -term friends only talk to till summer The time is ticking around four-ish, I think. I've done my makeup and my hair because your girl is ready to film a Zara try on haul. Yeah, Philip is left to work. I'm gonna be filming and then we are heading to the highest point of Dubai. It's a restaurant. We're gonna grab afternoon tea. I'm gonna be filming for like an hour now. And yeah, as you can see, the clothes are all laid out. I'm not sure about which setting. But I think because in my previous one I was sitting down and lots of you guys were actually appreciating the standing up bit. So I think I'm gonna be filming like this. What do we think? So I'll film and then I'll catch up with you guys when I am gonna go get dressed. We're done with the Zara try and haul and this is the outfit that I came up with. Actually throughout making the video I was like this outfit is phenomenal. So everything is Zara. My shoes are Stradivarius. And let's see what is the time currently five and yeah, we're heading off grabbing a taxi and going downtown To go to the highest point of Dubai and grabbing afternoon tea Okay guys, this place is 72 floors. It's called Javora Hotel. Yeah, it's apparently gonna be the highest point of Dubai. So 70 floors. No, 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 the highest hotel. hotel. View. Obviously, Burj Khalifa is the highest. But I was expecting to see the sunset, but it's a bit cloudy tonight or today, so can't really see. 
However, it's still so gorgeous. Like, we're so high up. The Burj Khalifa and then all Dubai around you. That's the ocean. But as you can see, it's like so cloudy. Could that be because we're so high up or up? Maybe it's the sand. But I mean, yeah, oh, it would have been so pretty like with the sunset and everything, but we can't really see it. We're just waiting for our friends. They're a bit late. Um, and then when they come, we're gonna order our afternoon tea and then they have a platter of cakes and stuff. Which is funny because I was like, I'm gonna start eating clean today. It looks so cute! So this is actually sandwiches. And then we have some sweets. Cute. <laughs> at the afternoon tea it was amazing however we got a little a little weak service not gonna lie was the guy who was a little bit like rude what are we doing now we go till uh... we go till <laughs> we're back home and it's currently around 12 I'm just gonna be taking my makeup off and my hair I'm so tired guys. But as you guys saw, we were at the highest point of Dubai. It was pretty, but then the service was trash. Um, and then we went to Smoky Lounge and just had a drink, mocktails. I'm gonna be taking my makeup off and gonna go to bed. I will see you in my next one. Until then, please subscribe to the channel if you're not already like, what are you doing? Love you guys so much and good night.